now a radical idea about changing the relationship between cities and water. We're really talking about the city as a sponge. It's part of the NPR Cities Project. For thousands of years, city engineers have tried to corral water. Think aqueducts. That's really the core of modern water infrastructure, and it's the ancient idea that the Romans gave us. Rain, precious rain, answered prayer amid an epic drought, just pouring off a roof, through a downspout, and straight into the sewer. Now, some urban designers want to change this. They say in this age of climate uncertainty and drought, a downpour should be captured, used for drinking water or for irrigation. But most of the time, it's banished to a river and on out to the ocean. Most of our neighborhoods in Los Angeles, we are required to send stormwater off of our properties as fast as possible. Get it into a storm drain, get it out to sea. Treating it like waste. Treat it like waste, exactly. Elmer Avenue is an experimental block that soaks it up. To treat it as a precious resource. Here's how it works. Along each sidewalk is what's called a bioswale, a sort of gully filled with drought-resistant plants. When it rains, the water collects and filters down into cisterns buried below the street. In an average rain year, this block puts enough water for approximately 30 families for a year. 